Hi everyone, I wanted to make another video to follow up on the one I made earlier this morning where I had to announce that I deleted a good portion of my content from the past couple of months that featured large language models solving physics and math questions because quite a few of those videos featured copyrighted problems from publishers and books that I don't have the rights to or course content from courses I've taken in the past in college and grad school where I wasn't the course instructor and didn't come up with those problems. And I know there's been a lot of comments in the previous video saying that this is a fair use argument that I can make and that I would win this and that I've transformed the content sufficiently to warrant me using it in the video as, I, as I've done. And while I may agree with some of these points, that actually wasn't really the main rationale behind it. And again, people might not agree with my reasoning here, but I, I just figured I'd explain because I do think it's not as black and white as some people might think it is. Uh, in essence, the person who reached out to me is someone that I know and I have rapport with and I've known since I started graduate school. And I'm not going to say who it is, but this person's known me for a while and I respect them. And even though I may not agree with their policy here, and especially if this policy is somehow being applied to me post-graduation, even though I don't know how that works exactly. I ultimately just don't want to be on bad terms with people in my alma mater or my past department for that matter. Okay. So that's kind of the crux of it. I know there are other you know videos I featured that didn't involve my alma mater and whatever, but you know, I think that I just don't want to open up this can of worms any further. And I can just make original creative questions that we can use to test. It just means the videos are going to have to slow down a bit because I'll actually have to think of the questions and you know solve them and you know verify them with these LLMs, which will take longer than if I just you know, pulled a question from a book or an old course that I took. I also just don't want to be a hypocrite because I've I've been on record complaining about how people have taken my content as a, as a creator and without my permission and have used it and. You know, I've gone after them and just said, hey, you know, why'd you use my stuff without my permission? So I, you know, I'm, I know you, you might argue that, okay, it's a corporation, it's a book publisher, it's whatever, you know, you're an individual. There's, I'm sure there's legal arguments to be made of this. And guess what? I just don't really have the bandwidth to deal with it right now. I'm really busy with work and I can't get into the specifics of it. But over the next two weeks before the new year, I'm going to be just absolutely swamped. And if you remember, YouTube is my hobby. And I want my hobby to remain fun and enjoyable and fighting a legal battle over this and you know making enemies of people of my old alma mater is not what I would constitute as fun. And so whether or not I agree with them or not, I think is irrelevant. I think that it's unfortunate it's come to this and I wish it wasn't this way, but to me it's just ultimately not worth all the the struggle. Right. And so I apologize again. It's just I don't want to make enemies. I really just don't. So that's basically it. I will be making you know more videos in the coming weeks. Hopefully, if I get around to it, I'm just really busy with work stuff. But uh, I appreciate your patience with me. I know OpenAI is doing their 12 days of shipments, and there's been some pretty cool stuff that I've tried out since they've been releasing them. But I just haven't had the time to get around to making actual content with with their stuff so uh, when i find the time to i will i will do my best to get to it but in the meantime i appreciate your patience i know this is a bit of a shock perhaps to to see a lot of the content that got me attention got this channel attention um, go away but um i'm going to figure out a plan and just you know move forward with with the channel in a different direction stay tuned appreciate your patience and uh, i'll be back